It's 8 a.m. from Fox 35. This is Good Day Orlando. A new app claims that it will have your kids begging to do more chores. Begging. It's all about a reward system. <laughs> Luann's here to show us how the app works. Good morning, Lou. Good morning, guys. Doesn't that sound good? Well, there are several apps out there that help you assign chores to your kids and then monitor their progress. Some even give out rewards. But we found a few that offer up something new. And joining me this morning is tech guru Tom Jelnick with On Target Web Solutions. Good to see you. Thanks so much for Thank coming you. in. I guess the good old days were you could just tell your kids to do chores, and when they say why, say, because I said so. Yeah, that doesn't over, work huh? anymore, does it? No, we have to reward our kids. So this right. first one sounds really cool. It's called Chore Monster. I love this. And this one says it's going to have your kids begging to do more chores. See, could it be? I think begging is probably a relative term, uh -huh. but, uh, but I think the coolness factor of this, we have monsters. You know what else this app has? What's that? Fart noises. You're kidding. No, oh my serious. gosh, this is a boy's dream. Absolutely. Monsters and fart noises. My little angels wouldn't appreciate it as no. much as maybe yours. Yeah, because you have girls, I have boys. <laughs> but this is a this is a great app. Um, really helps to keep kids motivated. Um, they can earn rewards. They can get newer and improved monsters. Okay. So I think it's really cool. This uh, and it's free. So oh my gosh. Price is right. Yeah, my son would love this. So what? You kind of set up the chores, and then your kids say, "I did this today. I did that today." Right. And you can set up reward systems. You, this one also prompts you for maybe things you didn't think about around the house, like cleaning the hamster cage. Oh. So it gives you some ideas of stuff to keep them busy. Okay. The I next like one it. you're talking about is you rule chores. What do you like or dislike about this one? So this one's really colorful. Um, this also helps you, helps your kid kind of elevate, right? So the more chores they do, they get higher ranked in terms of an avatar. So they get cooler and cooler images. Uh -huh. Really helps to keep them tuned in and motivated. Um, it's really great with charts and such too. So if you're a really organized parent, this one will really help you out a lot. But does this one have fart noises? It doesn't. Oh so. man, <laughs> maybe it's better for your daughters. Right, I, it very well might be. Um, and you can see there's some princesses and stuff too. So my kids would love that. Yeah, more girly. Okay, right. the final one you're focusing on today is called Chore Pad. What's the deal with this one? Yeah, this one? one, again, no fart noises. That's uh -huh. problematic. But um, <laughs> certainly this one is great even for teachers uh, to kind of keep the class organized and such. So again, it's got the reward system so kids can see the great stuff they've done. And you can pick out the slackers pretty easy too because ah. it shows, you know, Sally's doing this. Johnny didn't do so much this week. Okay, so, so you can pit your kids against each other. Yeah, maybe. that's fun. <laughs> right. So, you know, the parents have to be entertained just as much. Yeah. Well, some cool things for you to mm -hmm. check out and get your kids to do chores this summer. Tom, mm -hmm. always good hey, to, see to see you. Where can people find you? On targetwebsolutions.com. All right. Thanks so great much for you. coming in. Thank you.